Hello everyone, welcome back for what might actually be the conclusion to Retro Game Challenge. And we're in the middle of the cutscene here. I did have it. And episode three is now completely clear. So let's watch the end, shall we? Ah, the ward regenerated. Well, they died! Of course they did, come on. Now, do we know who Haggleman Lady really is? Have you figured it out, people? Like we really care that much, but anyway. Yep. Yep. Of course. Yeah, of course. You knew that wasn't going to be the end. We had one more person to sacrifice himself here. It's not that difficult, though. You know, fighting isn't generally the accepted method. Dating, maybe? But, maybe you're robots, who knows? And there goes Haggleman Lady. Hey, and they're all alive. Surprise, surprise.
And the credits finally roll. With kind of a pretty tune playing in the background. Ma Chen and Zappy. names. <sighs> I actually do like that game a whole lot. That game is actually a whole lot of fun. Happy End. As Arena would say, YATA! I did. I did beat the last challenge. <sighs> I didn't. I will, probably. Eh, go figure. You just sat there and griped the whole time. What do you mean we went through a lot? Oh wait, you had to watch Rally King SP. Yeah, that counts. Pain? Sorrow? We're still talking about Rally King SP, aren't we? Yes, I did. Yeah, but then you'll go make TV show and forget all about me. And sound. Yeah, we have an unlockable sound menu. To take this game so seriously. Why do I have a feeling I'm about to see a repeat of the end of Takeshi's challenge? Okay, never mind. He's happy. Take it seriously. Yes. Yes, I do. <laughs> no. No, it won't. Yes, it was fun. Ah, good. Now you can go get beat by your friends at more modern games. <laughs> of course you will. Except for the fact that this, um, this game didn't sell well enough to come over to North America for the sequel. Oh, 
I'll have a hard time forgetting this. Catch you later, Arena. Just in case you're wondering, yes, I actually am playing on a very narrow field, so if something comes in almost directly from the side, it's going to be really hard to see. This is for Rally King SP. mess with this too much when I was beat it way back then. Face is now flesh colored. That didn't go well for me. Wow, he's in bad shape. Got him! A winner is you! A winner is me. Indeed. So. Nothing to see here. You know what that tells you, right? It tells you there is likely a very good chance that there is something to see here. So I'm going to let this run. And I do believe I know how long I need to let this run for. I said nothing! Yeah, keep saying that. I know how long, I know about how long I need to let this run for. So I am going to let it run. I'm going to be quiet. Well, not completely quiet, but... This has been Let's Play Retro Game Challenge. I hope you've enjoyed watching it, despite how horribly I s a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Despite how horribly I sucked at this. I hope you guys had fun watching it. Because I really had a lot of fun playing this. Even though this isn't the first time I've ever played it. 
And yes, I really do. I really do like just about all the games in here. Rally King and Rally King SP. Just because it's a joke. No, not really, really happy with those. You know? Rally King wasn't a joke, but the SP was. But anyway... Yeah. So, Game Center CX. By the time this rolls around, Game Center CX will have been out for quite a while, actually. The DVDs, you Dude, know, the one... didn't you hear me? Yeah, I heard you. I just don't believe you. But, um, yeah, as I was saying, Game Center CX, the DVD, the best of set, I don't know how well it will have done by the time this video is posted. It's still the first week of September as I'm recording this. And the game does, and the DVD set doesn't release until the 18th, I believe. So I have no idea what the sales numbers look like. I really do have a sincere hope that the sales numbers are good enough that they start bringing out the box sets. The full, you know, seasons. And I hope I've convinced a few of you out there do take a chance, watch a few of the episodes I've put, been putting in the descriptions, and maybe, just maybe, take a chance and pre-order the DVDs. If that happens, maybe we'll see the box sets. I can hope, anyway. And while I've been talking, I've been petting my cat, because she jumped up on my chest when I set the controller down after the game was over. But yeah, this really has been fun for me. I really do enjoy this game a lot, and it did really upset me when uh when there was no when the sequel never made it over here. Yeah, I mean I know they're working on a ROM translation, and if they ever get that ROM translated, you may see a let's play of it. Who knows? Man, it's late. But here I am. 37 years old. Dosing myself in nostalgia through Retro Game Challenge. Pseudo-nostalgia, maybe. And petting my cat while I watch a starfield scroll by in end screen. Yeah. It was kind of cathartic getting to blow up arena, though. And now the cat's about to fall off my lap. And there she goes. So anyway... I'm not completely sure what I'm going to be recording next. Still waiting. Yes, I am. And I've got to wait about 25 more minutes. Fancy that. But you may have noticed he doesn't shut up. In fact, he will keep talking at various points. Until the half hour mark. So what I'm going to do is now that I've kind of given my closing thoughts here, I'm just about to shut up. I'm going to keep recording until he's done talking. Then I'm going to kind of cut the video out. Cut out the bits and pieces of video that don't have him talking. And we'll go from there. So anyway, thanks everyone for joining me through this Let's Play of Retro Game Challenge. Again, it's been fun bringing this one to you. Kind of an unknown title because, well, nobody bought it. 
And I think nobody bought it because it just kind of looked like a generic, you know, old 80s uh, compilation disc that get released by the dozens. So anyway, thanks again. Hopefully, again, hopefully a bunch of you have bought the DVDs. A few of you at least. And I guess I will see you all for whatever comes next. Popular consensus would lead me to believe everybody wants Sam and Max next, but we will see. By the time this goes up, I'll have already started recording it and I will know, but I don't know right now. I need a day or two break. Because A, I am tired. And B, well, I just need a break from recording games. So yeah, I'm kind of stretching this out a little. <sighs> so anyway. I'm going to go ahead and shut off the microphone. And when I come back... Well, I may not come back. We will see. Yeah, I'll come back and give my typical exit outro farewell. <laughs> so, the next things you should hear should be a rapid fire. Well, not completely rapid fire, but should be a compilation of the things Arena will say after the game is over. So, see everyone later, and by later I mean about 20 minutes for me from now. You got way too much time. See ya! Doodles! And there you have it. That was really it. Toodles is what we get to go out on. Keep pressing L or R button when entering the credits. Yeah. I don't think I'll be showing that off now because I don't have any reason to. But yeah, really nothing more left. That was all spread out over the course of about a half hour. Yeah. Go figure. Anyway, as I said before, thank you all so much for joining me for this little trip down semi-quasi-nostalgia lane. And... I probably will be back with Sam and Max. Eh, people are waiting for it. I'm going to get to it someday. Might as well be next, huh? But we will see. So anyway, really, truly, take care, everyone, and I will see you all back again later for the next Let's Play. Retro Game Challenge. Surat! Off!